Hey, good morning, guys. I'm in uh, beautiful southern Nevada. Nice spring morning. Pretty excited. Not just because of the weather, but because of my new uh, Ruger. Just picked up the uh, Ruger PC carbine, 9mm. Just got it yesterday. Haven't even shot it yet. So, right off the bat, my son and I, we're going to start putting rounds through this. And then throughout the video, we'll go over it. I've only done two things to this. I did put a little Bushnell TRS-25 red dot on this. Great little scope. I've got, actually I own several of them. I've got uh, a couple videos on YouTube covering this scope. Really like it. Looks good on the uh, PC carbine. And I did change out the uh, uh, magazine adapter to take a Glock magazine since I do have a Glock 19. This comes with the two adapters, one for the Ruger SR9 magazine and again one for the uh, Glock magazine. So let's set up some targets, do some shooting and like I said I've never shot it so the scope's not even sighted in yet. So I'll get it sighted in turn the camera on and my son and I put some rounds through this and uh, I'll tell you guys what I think after I shoot it. Okay I've got the rifle sighted in so now my son's gonna shoot it and uh, warm up a little bit. Go ahead son. think that's nice like it nice and accurate let's set up some more targets all right let's do it let me show you why I love a red dot on a gun like this and I am wearing earplugs by the way I think that far right one was falling as I shot, but if it hadn't fallen, I would have hit it. But, uh, son, you're up. Hey, that bottle on the uh, right, apparently I did hit it on the way down because it has a bullet hole and it's empty. Hopefully we can see that in slow motion, but uh, anyways, son, you're up. Not quite as fast as you, but but it's do. fun, isn't it? All right, let's set up something else. Oh. oh. I got splattered too. Got a nice chunk right on the neck. <laughs> All right. Put safety on, point it up. Yep, I got splattered. And that was a hollow point. Wow. Hey guys, a couple things I want to go over real quick, and I'll tell you, my son and I, we're having a blast shooting this. Let me show you what I really, really like about this. If I lock back the bolt, 
Got a lever right here. Squeeze that. Barrel comes off. And I can tell you, this will fit in a Ruger 1022 takedown nylon case. So, put this back together. Very simple. Of course, your bolt locked back, safety on. Bam, just like that. One of the things I really like about it. Second thing I like is I can use a Glock magazine in it. Or, if, like I said, if you have Ruger SR9, you can use those magazines. Perfect uh, setup for a uh, little red dot. Again, Bushnell TRS-25. This has very good uh, peep sights on it. Does come with two spacers, so I can actually make this buttstock a little longer, or I can take out this spacer and make it a little shorter. Now I'm 6'2", and just a little short for me, so I am going to put one more spacer on this, and I believe it will add about half an inch to it. Really like the, the stock on it, very aggressive uh, forearm. Of course it's got the 1913 rail on it. Charging handle, you can put it on the left side. You can also change the magazine release to the right side if you prefer. Ruger just really hit a home run with this. But uh, let's set up a few more targets and uh, do some more shooting because I'd rather be shooting than talking. Good job. Your turn, Dad. Okay, hold on. Let me take a look at that. Go ahead and turn it so I can get a profile shot. There you go. That is a pretty firearm, isn't it? I like the fluted barrel. Beautiful. All right. And that's how you do that. Hey guys, I want to talk about this little red dot scope just for a moment. Again, Bushnell TRS-25. Perfect scope for this, uh, for this Ruger. Again, a red dot. Now the dot on this is uh, three mil, which means it covers about three inches at 100 yards. So it's not too big, it's not too small. In fact, on a gun like this, it's perfect. It's got 10 settings on the brightness. Uh, setting 10 is, is really bright. You can see it really good on a bright day. Now set on 7, Bushnell says that battery will last 3,000 hours. Normally I have this set on 6, so I get, I get at least 3,000 hours out of this. In fact, I haven't changed this battery in probably 3 years. Again, great little scope. Um, the click adjustments are half inch. Anyways, oh, you know what? If you like to shoot fast, get you a scope like this. I did a video on a Ruger 1022 with this scope on it. Had a blast. Check out this little video clip from that 1022. I'll tell you, if that, doesn't, if that doesn't put a smile on your face shooting like that, then you should just go home and, and bake a fruitcake. I'll tell you. <laughs> I don't like fruitcake, by the way. But anyways, guys, think about, uh, if you get this rifle, think about that little scope, okay? Let's get back to shooting.
Hey guys, I gotta tell you, I absolutely love this Ruger. It's been a blast, my son and I, man. We just had a lot of fun with it. This is probably gonna be one of those guns I'm gonna keep forever. You know, about 20 years ago, I had the original Ruger P9, I think they call it, or PC9. Similar to this, but just didn't much like it because it was heavy, it was just kind of awkward. This one is a totally different design, absolutely love it. So, I appreciate you watching my video, and uh, we'll see you guys next time. I'm going to take one last shot, and uh, as always, thanks for watching. Make sure you subscribe, and we'll see you guys next time.